Long-term local, Lynn Hanna. We're here on the Morning Show Channel 18 outside television talking selfies to you. Selfies to you dot com. You know, hit that website hard. Please. Uh, Lynn, let's talk golf for a minute. What's, what's, uh, you've been obviously in the golf industry your whole, or for quite some time, since you got a horticulture degree, is that what you said? A uh, little certificate at a golf academy type place, but yeah, I've got into the golf business about 25 years ago and definitely digging it. So, so do, you have, do you have a memorable hole? Have you ever gotten a, eagle, or a hole in one or an eagle or anything? A uh, hole in one just once at number 17 at the Phoenician in Phoenix, Arizona. What? You really did? You, you got a hole in one? Yeah, but... <laughs> It was more expensive how the, how the than gambling rewarding. Go. Yeah, right. <laughs> but, so you're more of a Bill Murray golfer or a Chevy Chase golfer? Ah, uh, definitely Bill Murray. Oh, there you go. Yep. That away. That's that's the Winter Park way. We'll up go here. with the yeah. Gunga Galunga every time. So we've, we've got a great example here. I think Turner got a few shots of the um, frames. Uh, you do a beautiful job here. So this is. Thank you. Let's talk about these frames. Um, this one looks straight off the tree. I love the just kind of natural. A lot of beetle kill. It. So this is our beetle kill. Yep. Okay, I see a little bit of bark on the Could be a little bit of blue on the inside of that as well. And um, it's, um, you can tell a little bit on the sides from it and whatnot, but a little bit of staining and all that works well. Most of the wood I use though is recycled wood. If you're tearing down a deck or something like that, I really hope that you'll give me a call so we can put that to good use instead of the landfills or burning it. We got some great old buildings and old sheds and barn wood. I'm sure there you get some of those beautiful frames out of it. If we can keep them historic, let's keep them historic. But if they're going to be out of here, then let's put the wood to good use. And so you can flavor it up with a little color if you got a springy picture or something like that. Exactly. So you can green and uh, I saw some pink ones or just anything really. I'm sure yep. you can pretty much take to order. And actually, the brighter color ones are they sell quite well for so, us. So there's two big parts of the business. One, you're going to show up to an event uh, and you're going to be making the pictures, frames with you, I assume, putting them right together. Yep. How, do you, how do you make the frames? Uh, you, do you have all different sizes or is it a fixed, fixed product? Well, we're primarily with Selfies U going to be basically five by seven photos. Keep, keep it so, easy. So your frame box is going to be all five by seven. So yep, it's a little bit works. larger. And most of the cameras, when you start to get larger than the five by sevens, the photo just starts to get a little fuzzy. And I think this is a good uh, size to keep it at that way. Now, now I, I don't fully know, but like, a, you know, you get a pretty wide screen on a Picture, does that fit the 5x7 or do you have to crop it a little? Uh, it definitely fits the 5x7. Um, oh, easy. The five so by picture's seven straight up right to you? And my printer will self-adjust on all of that as well. Oh, nice. Adjust the size of the photo and try to make it the best photo possible. That's awesome. So uh, you show up, you get your picture, get your frame, you roll it. So that's part one of the business. Yep. Part two is let's get on that website and you can do custom orders, not just 5x7s. You can. If you have, like I say, concert photos, family photos, anything along those lines, um, it should, um, we can have it done usually within a week, week and a half or something. Nice, not too bad. Are you doing a poster side? Like, do you go pretty big or is there a limit <laughs> where you go? Well, the largest one I've done was one of the um, signs that came off of the top of Mary Jane where you can actually see all the trails, those real big ones. I think it was oh, like they actually had the 80 over by 90 or something like that inches, and it was. It was pretty interesting. Got her do. done. Huh? Did you do glass oh, yeah. and everything for that? Oh, uh, we didn't do glass okay. for that. that Just got the frame be, made and then. That would be pretty heavy for Well, it. that's what yeah. I was going to say. How would you even transport that? Yeah. Oh, it, that was Without probably the toughest it. part of the whole thing was transporting Getting things it. around. and Had yeah. to find a van and move it out that so way. You're obviously a crafty guy. I mean, these frames, the corners and edges are just beautiful. I mean, you do a great job there. So are you a woodworker, photographer, golfer? Like, what's the, what's the hobby list here? Uh, basically, it just started with uh, making frames and that's about it and from there i've done a little bit of coat racks and whatnot but nothing that is worthy of sales. mostly frames though so you've been yeah. doing this 2004 is that what you said 2004 you started just making some for myself and then a few people started asking some buddies about and yeah photos that they had other stuff that they had and yeah so it's nothing that's paying the bills per se but we're hoping selfies to you can can do that when, when did you decide to take it to events when did that happen um <laughs> Kind of happened when I heard that Dollar Shave Club sold for a billion dollars. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a, there's a, yeah, did it really? It did. <laughs> I did. It did. And I figured how many people shave uh, and how many people use Dollar Shave Club to shave. And then I said, how many people have actual photos in their phones or how many people have phones and then actually take photos with their phones? And, 
And it's just like there's a lot more people Constant. that do that. Yeah. Than and like you said, like me, I they take pictures. And I honestly have a hard time even getting them off my phone onto a computer. I just don't yeah. touch them. They up, just get forgotten. And up it's in like, the cloud, we can pull them from the cloud. We can pull them from Facebook, Instagram. They kind of have limited the size of their photo when you print okay. it. So I think I'm going to have to go to a little different size as well to fit those. Just to accommodate the Instagram too. I yep. don't even use that. I'm still pretty novice, but. Uh, but yeah, what what a cool uh, concept, and I don't know if you want to plant any seeds, but I know we talked about like you know some ideas for groups like going on a rafting trip, and uh, you know you can call it in or go on the website, you know whatever works best, yep. get the picture to you, and then you could have it delivered back to them. Almost instantly, we're hoping to between a five and a seven day shipping, just due to where we live. Right, as we say, <laughs> we call it Mount Mail up here. Yeah. Right? If it's, if it's two-day <laughs> delivery, you usually get it in three days. It's exactly. just that's how it is up here. It's always it. And so, you know, I like just the fact that we're using the recycling wood with this and we'll be able to do it. And with each purchase it's that you It's got personality make, to it, you know, it's just not, yeah, uh, yeah exactly. So. We're going to have a koozie also, and what that does is it'll fold down flat during shipping, and I can use it three different ways. One, you can cool your non-alcoholic beverage. <laughs> Two, it's a little bit of advertising for it, but three, it, it's also packaging oh, for it, it so you don't break ah, the glass and you're not throwing away packaging materials and stuff like that as well. Lynn, uh, so. making a smart. Well, Lynn, thanks so much for being on the show. Thank you very yeah. much. Well, appreciate looking it, forward Ryan. to seeing you on the course here. And see, <laughs> yeah, we're, we're going to make a side bet on the course when this break, when the break comes here. Perfect. But, uh, once again, Lynn <laughs> Hanna with Selfies to You. Dot com. Check him out, uh, get him to a party, or just get your frame ordered from him right on his website there. Stick around because after the break, we're going to have Country Ace Hardware on Casey Barris, and uh, it is one of the nicest hardware stores I've probably ever been into. It's an incredible little spot right there in Granby, and I they do uh, wonderful things for our community as well as um, all of us in need of hardware needs. So we'll be back. We'll be back. Awesome. Thanks, Lynn. Thank you. Lynn, awesome. Great <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <Chicken>. <laughs>